Welcome back everybody, this is Home Harbor. Today we're going to speak about the nailing, nailing of the deck, weathering, we're going to weather our deck and also I want to start the video with something a little bit different. When we did unboxing I found out that my anchor is a little bit damaged, not much but it is damaged. So, this is perfect opportunity to show you how your warranty does work. I enter Ocra site, there was instructions, I fill all of the forms, then a few days later come envelope with new anchors. Two of them brand new so this is how your warranty works this is awesome this is really really cool so now what we're going to do okra suggests us to do nailing by just pencil I think we should do it a little bit different. So how it's going to be? We did already this part different. This one also different. Now here is just varnishing, I suppose. After you do the nailing, you just varnish your deck and that's all. I have some little different solution for you. I made homemade tool for this and I will show you how does does it work so guys don't laugh very much but you all know this pen like a pencil I don't know how to say it in English you see that part is look just if we take this off like the hole that we need to do in our deck, like nailing. So, I take off that part with the hole. I put it in the stick. That's why I told you not to laugh, because it's not a joke. It's my own handmade tool. And now I will show you how I do it. You don't need to do a lot of pressure you do need to make it big hole or something like that uh, I will try in the front it will be easier for you to see the way how we need it So guys, if you can see, we did the holes like this, right? Now, if you put a little bit, if you drew a little bit with the pencil, you will have that nailing simulation. So now I will do all the deck like this and then I will come back to you. So guys, I did all of it. I did hold the ship. Some places I tried too much. I covered this piece right here and what I'm about to do can look crazy. You may think that I'm crazy, but I hope my idea will work just perfectly because we have the pirate ship and this pirate ship needs to look old. I'm going to do an old deck. I'm going to do, do all of the ship looks old. And what we're going to do now, we're going to paint 
not die paint all the deck black don't need it's a uh, black matte acrylic paint don't need to apply big layer but yes it's need to be covered needs to be covered all so let's start So now guys it's completely painted and dry so let's start sanding. So guys it's done, now we're going to stain it with the walnut tie, I dilute it with the water, a lot of water, and it's probably 20% stain, 80% water, and remember you can always add more, start with less and you can add more, because stain when it's going to dry, it's going to be a little bit darker than in the beginning. So guys, we are done, it looks awesome, we just need to wait a little bit until it dry to show it all the fact, but I'm very happy with the result. So guys, for those who are not doing the, the, the older way, the older look, the old shift, uh, I want to show one more time how I'm doing the nailing process with my tool. Maybe you will be interested because in clean surface like this and clean deck, I just did a piece of deck to show you. You will see better how does it look. So we will do them. You don't need, you don't need to do a lot of strain. You can do with the pencil things around. 
put the circles around. I will do quick this part, then I will show you how it's going to be with the stain. If you're going to stain it, not with the black color, not with the black paint and then stain, just with stain or just with varnish. Now you can sand it just a little bit. Now I will do piece, for example, with that stain that I have walnut, that I diluted with water. I diluted a lot with water. See how it covers the holes. Because the stain go inside the holes and make that simulation of the nailing. Or if you want to do it, if you want to do your deck more light, you can use we have the pine stain. It's worked just fine. And here you go. Sorry for this piece of wood. I'm just trying some colors. So guys, we're back again. It's already dry. I love the way it look. Just awesome. Now, I covered the entrance because we're going to paint it black. We could do it, do it with all of the deck, but okay, I didn't thought this through. Let's paint it black. Okay, it's good. Now it will dry. So now we do the same thing with those small pieces. They're making parts covering the holes for our masts. Let's do the same with them. Now let's give them a little bit of time to dry. So guys, it's dry. We can continue to work. To work. What we're going to do, let's just give a little bit of sanding to this part to make it look old. Try to do with the edges first. They will be like this. So I think this part we need to sand it a little bit more, like it was more used. Well, guys, this look nice. I think it's enough. Now, do the same thing with those things, with those parts, small one, just a little bit. And now let's give a little bit of stain. I use the same one as I did with the deck. It's walnut stain, diluted with the water, a lot of water, just a little bit.
awesome. Now, these round parts, we can glue the place they belong to be. How I'm doing it, I'm using the same pieces of stick to put them in the right position. So I put just a little bit of glue. Yeah, right. Awesome. So they are right position. They are glued. Now we can take this off. Awesome guys. I really do like it. So, the last thing that we're going to do in this video is making our stairs. So guys, I did the stairs. I didn't film it and I explain you why. These are original stairs from Okre. But these are leftover that I have from my candelaria so there is a lot of pieces of them and it will take i glue here part i glue here part it will just take me it will just be a boring video but i will explain you what i did those parts that come in the back i stained them with the same walnut stain diluted with the water then the steps i paint them black then I send them down like they are used, like someone used them very a lot of time. And then again, give the stain. So I think they look really old, just what we need. And now let's just glue them. So guys, it just look perfect, just the way I need it, just the way I want it, awesome, old look, I'm really really happy with the result, I hope you enjoy it. This is how it went with the planking, with the weathering, the weathering is just awesome, it's just really beautiful. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the process. If something you don't understand, uh, which stain I use, what proportions I use, what I did, uh, just ask me in the comment section. I will always respond to you. Uh, even if you want to have just some chat with uh, about the ships, you can follow me in my Instagram. I will link, I will leave link in below. So. It is awesome. My idea with stairs is working. I am really happy. So, our next thing is going to be preparing our hull for the first planking. So, we're going to use all of those bunch of small parts that we have from the beginning. And then we're going to work with bulwark. But before gluing them, we need to do holes for our cannon so there is going to be some math and i'm really bad at math but uh, it will take some time to put them just right the holes for our cannons like they should be so our ship will be beautiful but you don't need to do all of that math i will do it for you 
So guys, I hope you enjoy all of this like I did. And thank you very much. Thank you for watching me. Subscribe my channel. And see you next time.